everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to make a video about going back to school because I went back to school a few years ago. So is it ever too late to go back to school? Uh, the answer is hell no, it's not too late. I went back to school four years ago. Along my path, I have changed my degree. I wasn't exactly sure what path I wanted to follow and it took me a little bit of stumbling to find out the path that I wanted to, to uh, follow to get there. Can you stop with your fingers? We'll uh, get a little bit more into that in a bit, but first, we are shopping for a hot pot. Find a pot, make it hot, hot, hot. Hey, Dan. How do you do hot pot? You find a pot, you make it hot. So I forgot to film inside the store. The grocery store that we go to is called H Mart. It's a Korean grocery store. They're kind of like all over the United States. But um, anyway, we were on a 15 minute timer where we parked, so I kind of got stressed out and I forgot to film. And, and anyway, I'll show you what we got when we got back home. What does H stand? stands for Hungry Person's Market. What does H stand for? Do you even know? H-O-R-N-Y Person's Market. With your mushroom, lotus, uh, tofu, glass noodles, regular noodles, and pork. Oh yeah, and the veggies. Okay. This one is outside, so spicy. I can't, I, I can't even like, my tongue feels weird. Water tastes funny, a little too spicy. Too spicy? No, it's fine. Through the smoke. Oh, we made it up the mountain. I uh, decided to do Runyon today just to get a little bit of exercise in. Runyon is like one of the more popular hikes around here in LA and it's been closed because of uh, COVID for the past year, at least half of it was. So half of the trail is kind of challenging and it's really kind of uphill and rocky and the other half is like this sort of paved road that's a lot easier. They kept the paved road open, but they didn't keep the, uh, the more difficult one open. Anyway, so they've reopened everything. They took all the fences away and it's open for everyone to enjoy again. So we decided to do it. Uh, Shane and I, anyway, we came out and did the, did the hike today, but um, Man, I am out of shape. It's been a good year since I've been able to do any of this stuff. So at any rate, it's it's nice to be able you know, to do it again. Hopefully we can work it back into the regular routine. It's a really cloudy day today in LA. So that's like the ocean. And on a clear day, you can see that. And then you've got, uh, you've got downtown Los Angeles over there in the distance. You can kind of see through the haze. And even from here, you can see, see if I can get a little closer. Even here you can see there's the Hollywood sign. Again, it's really hazy today, so not a good view, but yeah, it's still a nice day. So back to the topic of going back to school. I know I said I've been in school for four years already, and that was because I didn't really know what I wanted to do. Okay, so I feel like I need to backtrack just a little bit. So after I graduated high school, I, I did go to college. I went for just a little bit, and it really wasn't for me. And a lot of that has to do with, I think, the way that I experienced high school, which I'll make in another video. So shortly after high school, I actually went to beauty school, and I followed in my mom's footsteps. She was a hairstylist, and I became a hairstylist uh, soon after. Uh, not soon after her, but you know, soon after uh, high school. All of my focus was was in in beauty and hair because it was something that really it really was a passion of mine. But always in the back of my head, there was just this burning desire to sort of finish something that I had started. And that something that I had started was I really wanted to finish a degree. I knew it had to be something in the creative field um, because I'd spent my entire life in the creative field. Communications opens the door to you know marketing and different forms of social media and, and YouTube and and things like that. So that was why I did that. Anyway, back to the video. Uh, hopefully returning to school at you know a little bit of an older age Maybe you've, you've tried out a few things just in life in general and you'll have a little bit more of a clear path But uh, I've got two years left to go to finish my career Which I think should complement my my love of doing you know YouTube We'll see you know what kind of jobs can come of it or whatever future potential there is. What do you think Shane? What do you think? What do you think was that a good hike? Shane was that a good hike? Love is love Love is love. I so I forgot that I got some clothes that I bought from China that got shipped over. And uh, yeah, give me. I bought these clothes. Quite, quite down over there. These clothes. So I'm just gonna try them on real quick and see what they're like. Um, not these. These aren't mine. These are garbage. Here, these are garbage. Yeah. So tough. You're so dumb. This is okay, but the shirt's a little. Skinny baby? Yes, dummy. <coughs> Coronavirus! 
is the first thing, and then there's one more piece that can go on it. <laughs> this I like. See, you didn't like this shirt, but this is actually, this one's actually kind of my favorite. Because they're basic? Because I'm basic. I'm basic. And this is basically, basically good. Best.